here at Tabor, we look at our clients as part of Tabor. Tabor is within the community, our clients are within the community. We've been, been here for 50 years, and we found out early on that people, just because we get them housing doesn't mean they can s sustain it. And so a big part of that was to give them education to be able to support sustaining the actual housing that they're looking for. We have uh, people of all races, intellectual abilities, uh, everyone can come in and um, take these classes. We reach out to different bank and credit union employees and oftentimes they're the ones that teach our workshops for us. And so they're available to come on site to lead the workshops here or they go to off-site locations. We sometimes host workshops at schools or businesses for their employees. And we also do them in different satellite locations, such as Ephrata and Columbia. Here at PA Career Link of Lancaster, we are one of the only career links in the state and actually the nation as well that has a specific reentry services department. So we're giving our clients the tools to be able to succeed. Um, it is up to them to use those tools, but we're helping bridge that gap. Um, we're also giving them that support and through kind of what we're doing with Tabor, they have the support of Reentry and CareerLink and all of our staff, but they also have the support of the Tabor staff. Building that rapport with the client, um, getting the client's trust, you know, looking at the client as they are a part of Tabor, they are a part of our our, we call Tabor a family, so they're part of our family. So we look at them as um, helping to educate them, as well as um, helping them to reach their goals. I, I love engaging people, and it makes me feel good to know that I'm going to help them reach a goal or reach their financial goal. I run into people all the time, especially the folks that I've, I've ha run into a few folks that were through the actual workshops that I did at one of the rehab centers. And then I see them when they get their first job after they were succeeded to go through that program. And they're like, oh, you're the Tabor guy. And you came in and, and I, that budget stuff, I'm, I'm trying to implement it now. So it's one of those type of things where sometimes it feels like no one's listening, um, but things are actually getting through to folks. I'm excited about the growth of this program at Tabor uh, because we're just seeing the need throughout our community, but it's building stronger communities. One of our largest increases uh, year over year has actually been in our first time home buyer program. Uh, we, we were seeing probably between 200 and 250 per year, and last year we were upwards to 400. What's drawing people to uh, Tabor's, you have so many committed and dedicated people here at Tabor. People that are committed in seeing clients and people through to all the way to the end of their goal.